Hey, what's up everybody? It's Matt from Rocky's War Room and welcome for our game two of our playthroughs of Gunfight Royale. So, game two, our playthrough. Uh, this time, we are playing Not a Social Visit. So, uh, let's see. Bitter enemies are in town on unrelated business. You start at ran a random number location on the board, and you start with no weapons and no items. And random items are all at the question marks on the table. Uh, and any of the unoccupied number spaces, the extra question marks will go after we place our fighters. Now, we're playing with a full six players, technically, but they're on teams. Uh, I have a team of two. Uh, Not Jay has a team of two. McMurray has a team of two. And it's a free-for-all with teams. Um, it's not a specified card this way, but it's still a free-for-all. You can take a couple characters at your board game, do what you want. So... That's our game, but the last character standing wins $2,000. Normally, you'd play this with just one character each, but I want to see what this does. So we randomly selected our characters. Uh, we um, The character cards, which are right here, the Gunfight Royale characters, we shuffled them up and randomly selected them, and I ended up with the Tomboy and the Old Timer. Uh, the tomboy, her eagle eye allows her to be uh, to make a called shot on a roll of one or two instead of just a one uh, using a rifle. She has to be using a rifle. Uh, and she ignores the lady, uh, the lady's effects. There's a character called the lady who has uh, that, that there's a effects that she does. And right. <laughs> yeah, she, has, she has the affliction titties. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, then I got the old timer. I believe that was what who you had last was. game, wasn't it? And that's good because he can he can help your your teammates pretty pretty well. You may encourage a character with uh, within six space six spaces on their on uh, their next turn. They receive a plus two accuracy and brawl, plus one brawling. Okay, yeah. he can run at a maximum of four spaces. His right calf and foot wounds deal zero damage, but still confer ill effects. Okay. Excellent. So, McMurray, tell us about your characters. What do you got over there? I have the Cowboy. The Cowboy's a wild shooter. If his shot hits all characters within three spaces of the intended target, roll a d20, and the highest roller takes the wound. He has heavy artillery. Okay. A born leader who wants per game. Or then I have the hero. Sorry. Heavy a born artillery. leader. Yeah, that was my fart. Oh. Nice. Uh, it's the hero. A born leader who wants per game may sacrifice his turn to allow another character to take a bonus turn in his place. He may not attack someone unless he can be seen by them. What? That's not my play style. His fighting prowess gives him a plus one to brawling rolls. So it's a challenge for McMurray to play a character that, that doesn't turn. do it. So. Yeah, sorry. You guys couldn't hear that. I didn't have the dryer with me today. <laughs> <laughs> so what do you got over there? I got okay. the sneak who honestly looks like a very, very pissed off Buddy Epson. Um <clears throat> He is, uh, he's wanted, as we all are, for $1,700. He's got a pickpocket. Uh, if uh, he wins a brawl, he can steal a card from his opponent's inventory. He's also got backstabber. If he brawls an enemy who can't see him during his turn, he automatically wins. If shooting, the throw, if shooting or throwing unseen, he receives a plus four accuracy. So he's a dirty little bastard. But... In normal games, uh, he would be carrying a throwing knife. <clears throat> My other guy is the outlaw. And uh, he looks like Duck Dynasty here. Wanted uh, $2,500 reward. He can conceal any card in his inventory under his duster. He's got the golden card built in. Oh, good. 
Uh, <laughs> this ruthless criminal ignores the effect of the lady, the dress, and bystander dirty trick cards. Say what now? He what? He ignores the effects of the lady. Oh, oh okay. All right. The dress. Uh huh. And all bystander dirty trick cards. Okay, so the dress is an item card that can conceal your. <clears throat> right. You can, you can put on. It's like the dress. Yourself as a lady. Yeah. Oh. That well, that's, I thought that was just your Friday night plans. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Um, <laughs> now, we don't start with anything. Right. Uh, now, your one guy has a lasso, does he not? Uh, no, because we aren't starting. Yeah, with I know, but uh, yes, does it otherwise say you would normally would... start with a lasso? Yes, otherwise mm -hmm. both my guys would normally start with Peacemakers, which I'm a fan of. Yeah. And then that's a good weapon. the cowboy, yeah, the cowboy would start with a lasso as well. Yeah. All right. So now we got to figure out where we go, right? Yes. So we're going to randomly roll for the spot on the map that we're going to be in. Um, so how do we figure who's going first? Uh, well, sorry, we're going to by character or by player? Just by player. Are we going to do? You but choose we, one. It, it's by it's by uh, whatever the uh, reward amount is, and then one thing that <coughs> I've done in games previously that might be cool. You add it up all together. Yeah. 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 I'm saying one thing that uh, might be cool to do that I've seen that I've played in games is instead of rolling randomly for both of them so you could start out with one guy here and one guy over here mm -hmm. you roll randomly and then you put one guy down and then you can choose one adjacent you know what i mean it's, yeah. it's up to yeah. you guys that's just something that can kind of aid in the this play. is just the card says start in a random numbered space yeah so no i gotcha but uh as far as teams go you're supposed to go in reward order even if you have these amount but we'll just add these together so together i have Forty six hundred. You, you definitely win. Cause I'm only worth thirty four hundred dollars. Forty two fifty. So, so forty six. I'll I'll go first anyway. Or forty two five hundred. So uh, four, let's see four, where no, forty two hundred. I missed. Oh, good lord, man. An eight. An eight. So right here. Uh, the tomboy's gonna start there, and we'll put her facing that direction. Okay. And seven. seven. Hey, oh, oh, so you've it. got that coherency going. Yeah. Oh, and look at this. He's in the outhouse. Right, right. <laughs> the old timers in the Thanks outhouse. That, uh, I think you might have a yeah. growing problem. <laughs> All right, so I'm next. With a four. That's going to be uh, right in the bank. That's where I started last time. He says. That's where I started Whoa. last time. Oh, that's where you started. And then. <clears throat> well, I guess, yeah. A 10. Ooh, starts in 10. Starts in the stable. You gonna roll for uh, wow. my cowboy here or wow. my hero here? Hero. In the box, please. Yeah. <laughs> Got him. Got him. Uh, seven. Already, already been taken. <coughs> nine. 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 Okay. Make sure you're facing the direction you want to face. Yep. All right, and now. The cowboy. No, no. Roll that. Dose. Two. Dose. Huh, that's odd. I figure Forrest would have put number two into an outhouse. In the barber shop. It's taking a bath. All right. That's sometimes right number two if there's no toilet paper and stuff. <laughs> now, all the leftover numbers uh, get a question mark put in them uh, on the numbers. Boy, how do the outhouses are full of stuff Five. now? One, three, three. Isn't that normally how it is? Uh, six over there. That's it. That's it. That should be it. Yep. Okay. So now we have no items. So obviously we're going to be go with no weapons. We're going to have to be uh, going for those. So <laughs> beginning of turn one, I go first. Uh, he's in. Mr. Outhouse is going to take his first action just to loot. Nope. That's my watch. Uh, that's okay, Siri. We're learning to. <laughs> I'm going to draw an item. I'm going to keep this item. And she's going, is that he? He? He's going to, it is concealable. So I will put it in his inventory. Actually, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. <clears throat> and then he's going to walk. Or uh, roll. He can only run a maximum of four, so I'll just roll yep. for that anyway, in case I get it. So, a four, four. So he's gonna go one, two, because he's going out the door, and three, four, Sorry. and he's gonna stop right here. Hmm. 
Uh, yeah, I'm going to stop right there. All right, your next character. All right. You got uh, Miss What's Her Nuts. Tom, the tomboy. That, that's rather fitting, I think. <laughs> Miss What's Her Nuts. Um, trying to decide what we're going to do with her. Uh, we're going to move. We're going to we're going to run. So one, two, three, four. We'll put her right here facing this direction. And we're going to loot for our second action an item for her. She has an axe, a wood axe. Yeah, that's the yeah, item. That, we, we know all about that wood axe. <laughs> yeah, we, we got intimately familiar with the wood axe. With the, uh, the axe fight. Swing for the fences. <laughs> all right. Um, so I'm next. And uh, we're going to have uh, uh, Jed Clampett here uh, move. Oh, well. who's, who's Jed? Uh, the sneak. Oh, okay. First of all, where are you guys at? You're there? Okay. The sneak is here. Uh-huh. Outlaw is here. Oh, you got separated. Yeah, we all did, except for you. Mm -hmm. And I'm going to move four. All right. So one, two, three. You can move diagonally. One, two. Oh, one, two, three, four. I'm going to grab the loots. All right. Where, which one's the uh, Item card, green cards. All right. Hey, I can, I'm able to uh, deploy immediately, right? Mm -hmm. All right. He's putting on a dress. <laughs> I was just joking about that. You didn't have to draw that card. Well, out of sight of all enemies, you may put on the dress by spinning it. Oh, I have to. Well, it says an action. Okay. Yeah, you're okay right. So um, that figures it's a whole lot harder to wiggle into a dress than just pick up a gun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but there you go. I, I will. I will wear this at some point. Yeah, um, good. I'm so glad you yeah, make sure that. you're out of sight. None of us need to see yeah. that. Yeah. All right, the outlaw. He gets a six. Six. He's moving six. So one, <laughs> two. I'm, okay, and that's all I'm going to do. <laughs> and, uh, or, oh, Lord, more axes, Jonathan says. Yeah. <laughs> so. Oh, nice. I'm going to deploy that. What is it? Ooh, he's Colt got revolver first, rifle. He got nice. the first revolver there. Oh, yeah, there repeating rifle, weapon. two handed, non concealable. It would be if I had. Uh, oh, wait. No, no you do have it a duster. Is yeah, this is on, on this character. <laughs> so I didn't have to show it. Oh, well. I'm a shower, not a grower. Uh, my oh. to... <laughs> Sorry, Donna. Come on, guys. <laughs> BG. <laughs> This is like when Todd I'm, I'm gets talking on his, about peanuts. Right. Yeah, this is like when Todd gets on his board game things and starts making dick jokes. It's just <laughs> weird. I don't know. It's unheard of. Uh, minus one to reload rolls. Uh, if busted, disables left hand of shooter, dealing one d three of damage. It's called chain fire and ouch. Yeah. It should also hurt your face pretty bad. But yeah, I would think too. so. Yeah. All right. All so right. that's my go, uh, Mr. Right. McMurray. <clears throat> we are going to start with. Hang on, the real time boy came in. Hello, so, wife. Let's say hello to everybody. Sorry for interrupting your live play with the. Uh, I had to drag Uncle Knickknack down the stairs. Oh, okay. Yeah, we had uh, took down the tree. Uncle right. and, uh, yeah, Todd says I never. Yeah, oh, we, bag. I we had oh, the the tree bag. We, she dragged oh, it down. Oh, go. And we got a phone call. Nope, it's an alarm. All That's right. my wake up alarm. Oh, we got wake up, go to work. Time to go. Jeez, a little bit jokes like that. Now Jay's been dropping the artillery over here. All right, the cowboy is going to try and run. <clears throat> uh, Jay, would you like to roll 2d3 for me? You got five. One, two. Plenty of time to get over to here. Uh, we're actually going to... Face towards the door? Yep. And we're going to pick up this loot. Get the loots. <laughs> I'm not trying to be picky, but moving through a black space... Well, you can't, and you a can't, corner, you can't move through that oh. diagonal. You actually you have to move through the door. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I was just pointing it out Jay for everybody should, else. I should get the Colt revolving rifle. Um, <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, that's if you want to avoid a go ahead. 
not yeah. super helpful, but that's okay. If that's All what right. you want. And then can you roll again for me, Nache, for the hero? He's going three. Three. One. Two, two three. three. And pick up that second loot. Keep going. Right, there go ahead. Man. Thank you. All right. Oh, sweet. I got a Lamat revolver. Have fun with that, buddy. You guys are screwed. <laughs> Uh, yeah, Lamette. So it's a nine-shot cap and ball, great big old cylinder on there. And then well, directly sure, under the barrel, there's a shotgun, uh, a real short shotgun barrel under there. Totally so you can, really, you can really have fun with a Lamette. I've shot a number of those reproduction Lamettes, and they are fun. They hurt like a monkey when you shoot that. Yeah. Depending on yeah, depending on how hot you want to get that shotgun shell, you can really have some fun in there. Now, does it have a damage modifier to it? Uh, yeah, if you shoot the shotgun. Oh, okay, okay. Yeah. So you can either shoot either or. Yeah, or yeah. you can get right up on somebody and shoot them in the face with a, you know, foreign shotgun. Uh, good to know. And who's that on? <clears throat> the hero. Oh, okay. So he's in the uh, stable. In the stable. Okay, good. Yep. And that was your two go? That was my two turns. All right. Nache, last but not least. No, he, he went before. No. Oh, you did. It's your turn. Oh, okay. So it's my so turn. So turn oh, yeah, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm still used to that whole turn sequence from last time. Uh, okay. Old man with pack porch. Um, he, uh, I'm gonna start with the old timer, and he's gonna run. Well, yeah. <laughs> One, two, three, and we're gonna go. F oh, I have to be facing that way. Four. All right, and he's gonna run again. Four again. Surprise, surprise. One, two, two. No. Oh, I'm sorry. One, One two, two, three, three four. four, and he's gonna go for this item token. And let's see what we'll get. Oh, oh a sawed-off shotgun. He'll take that. That's both hands, two-handed, not concealable. Damage varies with range, kind of like the uh, pepper box that I had. It only has two, two, uh, two, two shots. shots. Two shots. <sighs> we'll see if we can take care of that later. All right. So the, the tomboy, she's going to run a whole two inches. I'm two inches. Listen to me. Uh, one. Two, same thing. Run again. Hey, hold, oh. hold on. He couldn't pick that up. Why? That would have been your third action. Oh, you're right. You're absolutely right. Let's shuffle that back His in. Third action. I didn't mean Which to do that. He does. Oh, because he ran twice. Action. No, no, no. I, I, now, I next turn, he ran twice. He can do action. Action. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, she moves a whole one, two twice. again. So she stops right there. That's the end of my turn. Not Chase's turn. Now I go. Good catch. If we're moving too fast, please tell us to slow down, and uh, we'll explain a little bit more. But All right, so the outlaw is going to move three. One, two. Can't get over there. Nope. Because there, there is a climb uh, action. A, a climb action because there's not a line there. Mm -hmm. um, so, but he's going to go ahead. He's going to go ahead and move again. Thunder upstairs. One, two, three, four, five. Oh no, it's just a climb yeah, action. Climb. That's it. Yeah, I didn't have to. I didn't have to roll for it. Uh, All right. Um, my first action for the sneak. He's putting on the dress. <laughs> Gross. Go figure. On the dress. Yep. Uh, while warm, you may conceal all one-handed weapons in your inventory. You may not be attacked from further than six uh, spaces unless you have an unconcealed weapon. Uh, if you also have the duster, this card does nothing because you know the duster covers everything. Okay, so so now both of your people effectively have a duster. Well, this is only for one-handed weapons. Oh, okay. So even your the big like unconcealable pistols, yep, can be concealed. Yep. Now, is that the lady's effects or that's the dress effects? It's okay. just the same as the lady. Oh, okay. All right. As long as I'm not brandishing a weapon. Mm -hmm. You have to get within six inches of me, or six, oh, six spaces, spaces, to shoot me. Okay, gotcha. Because, because I, you, you, I look you look like, like a lady. I look like <laughs> a lady. Oh, Which is perfect for the sneak. Not till he looks like a lady. All right. We're going to go ahead and move him. Uh, he moves six. Who? Look at there. She? Moves she six. moves six. <laughs> it's ma'am. Howdy, ma'am. I'm always One, going for that. Two. Stupid vault again. Yeah, I am. Oh, well, that's okay. It's just going to take him an second action. action? Turn. That, no, that was my that second, was action. second action. Oh, it was. Okay. Yeah. Oh, you put on the dress. Yeah. Yep. yep. All right. Okay. Hey, Murray. 
Which, Mac which Murray, the cowboy, is going to attempt to run. All right. With a three. Three. Oh, you're you're killing me. I know. One, two. two oh no, three. three. Okay, I can get you there. You can take it. Okay. Oh, I toss it over there. Okay. And I have a duster. <laughs> hey, oh, he has right. the golden card. You know it'd be super cool if well, I had a friggin' gun to conceal in it. <laughs> um, I mean, like this Colt revolver rifle. Yeah, shut up. <laughs> or this wood axe, or anything. <laughs> um, yes, exactly like those. Um, Would you, well, you can throw this throw thing. Roll. Yeah. Yeah, it's a minus five accuracy. Oh wow! I did not know you. But could it still has a black. Yeah. Uh, crap, man. Uh, I guess the cowboy's gonna run. Five. Now, to point out, that's not an orange spot. No, yeah, it's an yeah, open you can door. walk right through it. Yep. yep. Just wanted to yeah, put, everybody, actually, put everybody at ease. <laughs> man, see, the issue is I'm gonna get shot if I run out there. You don't know that. What, are you not gonna shoot me? I didn't say that. Maybe. Because <laughs> you're going to shoot me or Matt's going to shoot me. Eh. What do you mean? Eh. I only have an axe. The lady? Yeah. She's, she's going around looking for a rifle right now. Not Jay. You, <laughs> want, you want to not shoot me for a turn? And I won't shoot you for a turn? <laughs> oh, <he's> right. <laughs> this is like playing Monopoly with your brothers and sisters. Right? <laughs> How about this? No. I'm not going to say that I won't shoot you. <laughs> Whatever. He <You> might. <laughs> Fine, then. Don't say you won't shoot me. Um, we're going to go... One, two, three, four, five. And I'm going to shoot Not Jay in the face. Oh, okay then. Challenge? Yes. Bring it, sister. <laughs> you mean sister? This is the outlaw. Oh, oh yeah, he's not wearing a dress. So... <clears throat> okay. So you're going to take a minus five? I am. I'm actually going to take minus eight because it's in a challenge. So you roll off against each other to see who yep. uh, shoots first. Yep. This is going to be for McMurray. For the two. This is for not Jay. A two. So we shoot so at the same time. All right. So I need an 11. All right. They're crossing out their <laughs> shots <laughs> with yep. their markers. <laughs> so I am... <clears throat> I'm just minus three, right? Yeah. And so I need a 16. Yep. Hit. Oh, we're gonna go. Since McMurray is the active player, though, we're going to roll him first. Need an 11, please. How about a one? Outstanding. A called <laughs> shot. What do you know? <laughs> I will take it. All right, now, uh, Dirty Tricks card. Yeah, there you goes go. Goes to the one yeah, shot. You can have that, not Jay. There's and a consolation. Draws, right? uh, I'll take one. Two. The way this works is, is if you roll a natural one on a d20 on a shot, he gets the the person five. shot gets a dirty tricks card, and the shooter gets to choose one of the five cards out of the wounds deck, the gunfight <coughs> royal wounds deck, and it's going to be a black damage. He's going to choose it, and you discard the rest of them. Yep, and I'm going to shoot you right in the neck. In the neck. <laughs> so you are stunned. I do I'm one. Already stunned. So. That's fine. I do. 1d3 plus 3 plus 3 for being within 2 with my shotgun barrel. So it's going to be 1d3 plus 6 damage to you, please. And this is the card, and he is stunned once he does it, but he's already stunned. Okay, so 1d3 plus 3. That's going to be 6 points. Uh, it's it's six plus points. 3 for the uh, damage on the shotgun, so it's actually 9 points. No, you said 1d3 plus 3. For that, he's plus dead. 3 because he's within 2 of the shotgun. Oh, Jesus, Mary and Joseph. He's already... What? I'm dead. You, you get to shoot me, though. Yeah. Seriously? Nine points. Oh, damn. I told you it's mean if you get within with that shotgun, man. 
One Jay. three plus three plus how much? Damage? Three. three. From being within two with that shot. Yeah. Holy smoke. I got a five. Okay, so you smoked me too. Um, it's just regular damage, I guess. What's it say on the it, special dirt rules? Minus one to reload, and if busted, disables the left hand of the shooter. So, I mean, you get to pull it. Watch, you're going to pull the headshot. Chest. Dirty God. Tricks. Dirty Damn. tricks. Oh, you shot him in the chest? Yes. Yeah. 1d3 plus 2. Now, the most he's going to lose is 5. Yeah. He will not be mortally wounded. Oh, man. I This dirty trick would have been fantastic if I had got it before. You're in a challenge. Okay. Did you add your minus 3 to the roll? Yeah. yeah he got okay. 5. He hit. Right. Oh, okay. All right. So, five, uh, 4. 4? And yeah. then what is it? What was the effect? Chest. Oh, so just four? Just, yeah. Four chests and four, four damage. Okay. Yeah. So that's about as best as I could have expected. And I'm already dead. Can you drop your rifle there for me, my friend? On the second game. I'm not now. stunned. Hold on. Okay. First blood. First blood. <laughs> Stop it. What? I never make jokes like that. <laughs> Wait, what did Jonathan Young say there? Criminal. Criminality. Cri oh, criminality. Okay, I was like, criminality? All over the place. For yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Real, uh, criminal. Show, uh, the items, you set them off to the side. Yeah. And McMurray is still standing. He's not prone or anything from no. the effects. Uh, looks like Forrest. Uh, is going to hop in here with us again. Outstanding. So he is done, and for game two, let me get him in here. And my dogs are barking. It would be very helpful if you guys could uh, show off what's going on on the table. So I, don't have I just shot uh, Nut Jay in the neck with a shotgun out of my Lamat. Uh, that didn't work out very well for him. No, no, it did not. To say the least. Um, so there's that. I just, in the language of the use, what is it? One shot, no scope, you? I don't know. Either way, I just blew your head off with a shotgun. Or right, yeah. Well, no, it was. Uh, it was your neck. I mean, I shot Well, yeah. So I it shot you with a quick 20 gauge box shot. It went, <clears throat> so it's from about three feet away, yeah. So, so there's not much left there. How about that? It, it, it was a. Uh, I was bludgeoned. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> there he is. With quite a bit of box shot. <clears throat> yeah. uh, horse, we can't hear you, buddy. Oh, I think I turned my mic off by accident. Oh, there he is. back. You're good. You didn't miss a whole lot. Not Jay's neck just turned into spaghetti sauce. But other than that, <laughs> groin shot was it the infamous groin shot? Uh, no, it was a shot to the neck with the shotgun barrel on the lamat from two spaces away and did nine damage in one hit. That's gotta hurt. Uh, yeah, I killed it. You know what? Wrecked him. Damn near <laughs> killed him. Yeah. No. Yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> wow. Hey, we're up to ninety-two backers now. Yeah, I know. I think you're looking at. Three. Well, I don't know. You're looking at one. <laughs> Hi. Hi. <laughs> All right. Cool. Yeah, most recent awkward one. Yeah. Yeah. You've got you've got at least three today. Yeah. From this. later tonight might be fourth. Yeah. Matt Chase got to ask his wife. That's the the nice thing about being a single dude is congratulations. Now I'm back in a Kickstarter. Yep. Sorry, wallet. Suck it. Okay. <laughs> so what is? Uh, What's your other character? Oh, yeah. Do? I forgot I had another guy. He would like to run, please. Of course he would. Cowboy would like to run. Two. That's what you get. Two. Cowboys uh, smell terrible, not Jay. That's what you get for killing the guy who's rolling the dice. It's <laughs> very true. Yeah, that's, that's uh, what we did. For or no, my, is... my cowboy went, didn't he? Uh, yeah, he's gone this turn already. Oh, okay. So yeah, uh, what we did was is we're playing the uh, not a social visit. You start with random number of space and no weapons or anything like that. But we took two characters each and based the turn on who uh, the combined value value of uh, each each character's or team's award to see who goes first, second, so third, that sort of thing. So we're at the end of the turn. Yep, and you you have mortally wounded, so we're going to move the Lone Rider of Eternity already. I'm lethally wounded. Yeah, he <laughs> reaches here. Game's over. Okay. Yeah. So three, one, two, three. Players with a dead character draw a dirty trick. There you go. Oh, you get to draw another. Thank God for small favors. Uh, <laughs> it, ended, it ended in an axe fight last game. 
Yeah. Oh my gosh. Straight up, yes. <laughs> not Jay and I hitting each other on the axes in the middle of the street. Partially because of these guys showing off the game. Partly because of the 28 millimeter gunfighters ball figs being offered. Yeah. yeah. Jonathan yeah, yeah. is one of your your backers there. Oh, excellent, Jonathan. And I'll tell you what. Whatever it takes to push this thing across the uh, goal line, I will do. And I appreciate my gunfighters ball players. Uh, you guys are are my treasure trove of of goodwill and enthusiasm and participation, and uh, and I definitely Ooh, wanted to, to like be there for you guys with uh, with that other version of the characters. <clears throat> Forrest, I'm not going to lie to you. I was not a huge fan of these characters looking at them on a computer screen. They look really good here, and then I saw the gunfighters ball figures. And I'm just jumping back and forth because those gunfighters ball figures look absolutely stellar. Well, they will always be there. The gunfighters yeah. ball figures will always be there. They'll, they, they will go into regular production alongside all the rest of them when this is over. Um, these, I, I've had other people tell me that were non-hobbyists. It was a little less intimidating to have oh, yeah. something you knew you didn't have to paint. You weren't feeling pressured to do something with them. Um, they're they're just cartoon characters. It's just Looney Tunes. I mean, that's that's yeah. all it is. So Matt, what I do? Oh, is it my turn? Yeah, what I do. All right. Oh, yeah. Sorry, you I was just doing did computer work okay. stuff. No, I did not. You just went. I just saw him go. Yeah. Uh, no, I don't think so. Uh, so the old timer is just going to loot and loot. So he's going to draw two top two oh, cards there. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah, fancy yeah. dancy. Greedy, greedy. Yeah. Fancy Nancy here. What the hell? Still no gun, but that's okay. It's okay. I have two not guns on my cowboy too. Put this here. Can it be concealed? Huh? Is it concealable? Yeah, it's concealable. Okay. All right, hey, hey. Yeah. It's All concealable. Right. It's being concealed. So yeah. is this one. I'm just making sure. How many pockets does your guy have? A lot. All of them. Okay. Hey, you know what's great? That's a joke. The dress. Not Jay doesn't have any pockets. No, but he's no, got a dress. Do. I do. Okay, well, he's well, going to add the frying pan. pan. Oh, boy. Is okay. he going to pull forward? Upon stuff? adding to your inventory, not hands, mark the area you will protect with the frying pan. You're immune to the wounds in that region. When, the, yep. uh, when a wound is deflected, the attacker receives a dirty tricks card instead of you and deals plus one blue damage if it's a bludgeon weapon, right? Now, this doesn't go on my hand. No, it goes, it in, goes in inventory if I'm going to protect something, right? Yeah. yeah. I'm going to protect the buttocks. Yeah, you should. Just like with, McMurray did. You should go with the gun. Because we're going to you know, go. You get $2,000 for winning this game, uh -huh. but if you get shot in the buttocks, you get a million dollar wound. But I hear you never see a cent of that money. <laughs> that's right. <laughs> um, so but that's, you get to show. You get, you get to show uh, yeah, you get to show LBJ your butt. Yeah. All that's right. And. Doing. The Tom girl, Tomboy is going to run. <laughs> Ooh, I had one. Twos. That means your Tomboy gets to the door. All right. She gets to the door. In classic paratrooper fashion, it's just run. standing in the door. Three. One, one two. two. And I'll move three, getting out of the way of the door. But you ran, so you got a point uh, to the wall now. Got a point to the wall. You're right. <laughs> just ran flat first into the wall. I Thanks. thought this room was bigger. <laughs> <laughs> All right, and that's my, both my turns, so okay. not Jay. It's my go. Yep. We're gonna we're gonna see if I can't open that safe. And I open the safe with a double. Are you kidding play. me? Here we go again. Again. Totally get that. Cartoon things are great, but a chance to build my twenty-eight millimeter <clears throat> collection is a giant plus. So, so that's a good question. Is it still two to move into the safe once I've opened the safe? It acts functions like a door once you're in. Okay. Yep. So, so yeah. I'll, I'll 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 to to run. Go ahead, Force. Oh yeah, I was just gonna say, yeah, that's a that's actually if you're already a gunfighter's ball player and you're collecting twenty eights, the Kickstarter itself is a is a good way to to uh, to ramp that up yeah pick up a bunch of the figures from the kickstarter because after the kickstarter is over this will basically be what you see here it'll, it'll be the you know when it goes into regular production this will be an alternative to to the full hobby you know you'll this will be the cartoons but during the kickstarter yeah integrate those characters in yeah this is a thing question for you Forrest. are those 28 millimeter figures going to come with it said they have hex slot bases are they going to be well, it said they have. Well, it said they have slaughter bases. Are they going to be the yeah. octagonal bases as well? Um, you'd have to 
uh, do a, a Sabbath for that um, because, okay. um, you know, we figured that the people buying them are primarily going to want to mount them up as Gunfighters Ball characters. The, the, the idea there is probably that you're going to use other Gunfighters Ball characters in the game too, probably, and make cards and stuff as we do because we're hobbyists. So we're going to do a lot of do-it-yourself stuff, right? So um, that was the idea there. And um, that, uh, yeah, that's a good point. We need to put out a, a sheet that can be printed and cut out for this for sabots for the octa octagon uh, it'd be easy enough for us to have octagon bases cut to to have a little baggie of those to have extra as an add-on i'll um i'll make a note of that yeah because excellent that's awesome i figured people probably if they were buying them and they already had gunfighters ball figures they didn't want some figures with oct octagon back bases and some figures with round bases they probably want them all with round bases and then do something else to adapt it to the game i was just gonna you know, put a dot or something on it. Sure. Yeah. Absolutely. Where the, the front was. It won't yep. be perfect, but okay, well, not you can easily see it's going to face compass points. Corner, yeah, exactly. yeah. Side, corner, side. Yeah. Okay. Nache oh, moved into the safe. I just want the damn And he picked up the money card, and you yep. got the cho he chose a random card out of the items deck. Uh, for this fella right here in the bank, <clears throat> McMurray moved his character over here and Drew a item card from the top. What are you going to do with it, Glimmery? Well, it's not a gun, so I'm concealing it. I just want a gun. I have three objects, and I just want a gun. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got in that cycle, did you, where you can't find a gun to save your life? I love it. <clears throat> and well, the hero would also like to run, yes. Four. Nope, he's not going to run over there. One, two, three, four. And I'm going to pick up this item. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Is right. it? Springfield rifle musket. So he has two guns and <laughs> one has nothing. Mm -hmm. I have an axe and three items. I have an axe on one and three items on the old diamond. But you have buttocks protection. I've got a dead guy. Oh, yeah, that's right. And a dress. <laughs> and a dress. <laughs> it's concealing something. <laughs> All right, Nache, where you at? What are you doing? It's your go. Uh, no, because we got to move the lone rider again. Mm -hmm. No, it's your go. I, I oh, go oh, yeah, I'm the last one. I'm the end of the turn. Let me know if that works. One, two, mortally wounded characters lose a wound. wound. Oh, so if you're only, yeah, so that gets you one wound, puts you back in the game. No, lose one wound. Lose, oh, lose one wound. Mortally yeah. wounded characters lose one wound. I'm sorry. Yeah. I thought dead characters get one wound. No. Nope. Nope. I are dead. Okay, yeah, that is yeah. I are you are doing. Yes. I are not dead. So she's gonna loot this area right here. Hand me a card, please. Towards is friggin' huge. All right. That's what she said. Oh gosh. I'll just put the ten gallon hat on. So uh while the ten gallon hat is in your inventory, instead of taking a head or hat <laughs> headshot wound, discard this card. Okay. All right, that's fine. Whatever. <laughs> I can't find a gun. She's going to run. Oops, I missed it. Go ahead. So three. three. It'll get you outside the door. No, it would not. I don't think it would. Yeah. One, two, two three. three. Get you out the door. There's nobody really around. That's fine. Well, so now, Mr. Mr. Old Man. I did. I have a rifle. Mr. Old Man. Okay, three. One, two, three. He's going to run again. Three. One, two. <laughs> three. Wah, wah, wah. All right. There I go. Oh, Charlie horse. That's what you did. Be careful. You all right? Ow. He sat on his pan. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> Dude, that was surreal. All right, six. <clears throat> um, I'm twine myself here. <clears throat> so one, two, two three, four, five, six. And my other guy's dead. He can still take another action. Oh, that's right. You can come over and ball if you like to. 
three. One, two, three. Face. All right. Face your move. There you go. Okay. McMurray? Was that both of your? Oh. <laughs> the, you only have one. The cowboy would like to run. Hey, Matt. Yeah. You're number one. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what are we going to do, Big Murray? Cowboy would like to run, please. All right. Three. No, for crying out loud. Cowboy would like to run again. Let's see here. One, two, three. Three. God, we alive. One, two, three. <laughs> and my hero yeah, over there. would also like to run for two. <laughs> if you could stop rolling like yourself, that would be great. <laughs> he's uh, he's sauntering. That's what heroes do. They saunter. They yeah. have to roll their hips when they walk. <laughs> he's rolling like not Jay. One, two. And then I'm going to switch out for my Springfield. Rifled musket. That's two hander. Okay, there you go. All right. <coughs> okay. and that, that's the end of the turn. Yep. Lone rider. Yep. Lone rider. Four. One, two, three, four. Each character rolls a d20. Lois rolls takes a bonus turn immediately. Okay. Not Jay. Oh. Right, we're gonna get it. Not Jay. What does your guy get? A ten. Okay. All right. This is for who? 16. 16. It, it's so it's not that, and then... One extra turn. Oh, it's just, and it's then just, for your other guy? Okay. Yeah. A six. All right, yeah. so for my cowboy? So you know, what do we got to roll? Just the lowest guy, so we got to... Oh, yeah. okay, okay. So you're currently got it. Seven. And then my hero? A five. All right. The hero. Oh, oh, come on. Uh -huh. We're going to see uh, how close we are to this little lady here. No. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I knew it. I knew well, it was going to okay. the lowest my, roll. My accuracy is still on the I can't challenge him. But I'm going to, uh, aim. I'm going to aim. To well, I can't either. Plus two to 13. And then I'm going to shoot that nice lady. I can't challenge him. i got to be within six spaces. Not only that, I don't gun. have any range. You have to have a gun to do yeah, that. Yeah, you gotta have a gun. Thanks for pointing that out. You can't hurl that axe at him. Not that far. I can throw well, it. No, but if he was. What do you think? Is this the Highland game? She can't throw an axe at him. <laughs> Great reference. I appreciate that. The Highland yeah. games. Are more Highland games than I can so count. If I were to throw this axe, that would be a <laughs> would twenty minus right eight. Up. That's a twelve. Right. How far can you throw an axe, Forrest? We have not done throwing yet. Oh uh, well, you, you got your basic. It's your basic throwing mechanic. You take your twenty, and mm -hmm. you um, you subtract the the range, and then that's your two hit number. And then your item. Any any instructions different than that will be on, on the item card. Oh, okay. It says throw. I'm dumb. I'm sorry. Uh, minus it says minus five accuracy when thrown. Okay, okay. so that sorry. means that yeah, exactly what it says. So you you need to roll less than a seven. Uh, yeah. It's worth a shot. Plus, but uh, you actually have to roll a. You're not within six. I can't challenge you. Yeah. You'd have to roll a uh, five, actually, because I'm behind cover. Yeah. How are you behind cover? Behind, I'm behind a horse rail. No. Okay, or not. Whatever. It doesn't matter. No. You can't throw it that far. Have fun. Throw it. Go for it. <laughs> no, I can't throw it because yes. I can't challenge it. I'll jump in here for a second. Anything, yeah. anything that isn't an open space or a sidewalk is cover. Oh, okay. Way. So you got to be, you so got to be able to trace a line of sight from your little arrow. Yeah. To, so the scrub stuff. So you'll be in cover too, Matt. Yep. So I need to um, hit you. That, uh, yeah. Right. So. Okay. That's okay. I was just gonna say the sagebrush doesn't count. That's about the only thing. Oh, oh. then never mind. I need a thirteen to hit you. A twenty. Ah, oh, crap! It's broken. Not necessarily. Roll I a D three. I, I thought a natural twenty was a. Well, D3 could just be a dud. Okay, go for it. I mean, it's a single shot. Oh, you roll the natural 20? Yeah. Hold on. Yep. That's a dud. So you, you, you just miss. Automatic miss. Okay. You'll be able to reload it. Or I'm just going to pick this thing up. Well, right. you threw it away. I mean, you threw it away, right? So after you've thrown it. Um, no, no, no. Th this is his rifle. Yeah. Oh, his rifle. I'm sorry. I was still back on the hatchet or the, the axe. Oh, all good. All, all right. right. Well, there you go, Matt. I didn't get it off. I didn't, I didn't kill you, buddy. 
I'm just looking to kill stuff. My watch is doing silly things. It happens. All right. So, Maria, um, oh, we're back to the top of the turn, which is Mateo. Me? Yes. Me? You. Okay, that's what I wanted. All right. Uh, I will loot with the old timer here. Not a rifle. Not a rifle. Not a rifle. Huh. I don't even know what that word is. What? Maybe I can interpret for you here. What you got there? That's a bandana. Yeah. Well, now everybody knows. <laughs> <laughs> no, down here it says, oh, as an action, use as a <laughs> tourniquet. tourniquet. I'm sorry, a tourniquet. Yeah. Yeah. Right. To recover 1D3 wound chips once. This guy's getting nothing but recovers. <laughs> I can use that. I'm yeah. going to use a tourniquet on my throat. And he's going <laughs> to, no, I need D3s. <laughs> You jerk. You guys are jerks. One, two, three. All right. Uh, the lady's going to run. Four, finally. One, two, three, four. She's going to run again. Four. One, two, three, four. No, no. Four. There you go. And you're not you you weren't gonna run for the the, the loot in the middle of the town right there? Hell no! <laughs> I ain't got no weapon, man, but an axe. Of course, I could have brawled you, dude. Good. It is what it is. We saw what axes do. Yeah. Well, she's thinking. running for the edge of the board. I think I know what scenario you're playing, right? Uh, no, actually, it's uh, th this is uh, it's a run away like a scared little yellow chicken, livered yellow belly. The last character standing. Uh, oh, okay. No, there's four. It's uh, not a social visit. Oh, okay. really that explains why he didn't have a weapon. And a loot. Yeah. He's still trying to find one too, isn't he? Yeah, the old something, timer is. Something better than a uh something axe. better than a uh axe. <laughs> oh, okay. we've, all, we've all got a character that doesn't have a good gun. Excellent. That's the way that one's supposed to play out. No, we've got a character. Each of us have one character that doesn't have a gun. Mm -hmm. But somebody managed Somebody managed to get mortally wounded, so that triggered the uh, rider. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Like, first in turn. Yep. All right. Now, uh, I'm like, hurry because I only have one damn character. My cowboy would like to run, please, Mr. Not Jay. Four. Well, it's better than the two you were rolling. I'll take it. Jeez. Getting all up in Nut Jay's business here. That's all right. One, two, three, four. I'm going to take a loot that I'm standing on. All right. Oh, for Christ's sakes. <laughs> what? The gosh darn, darn, darn. <laughs> Damn. I got a one. Like, I guess I can't say I don't have a gun anymore. Is it concealable? Yeah. You can say you don't have a gun. Yeah, but I mean, I want to have it on me. Well, I guess I don't have to worry about it, but it's an action to take it out otherwise. Who is this going on? The cowboy. He has a more derringer. Oh, okay. Pepper gun. Or not pepper gun. A belly gun. A yeah. belly gun. All right, and then my hero. Pea shooter. Well, run. Four. Which way are you going, buddy? <laughs> I'm going to not take the chicken livered way out of this. <laughs> One, two, three, four. All right. Okay. And loot. This guy. Second action. We rolling for the lone rider now? I got nope. a Bowie knife. A Bowie knife. Well, he's kitted out. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Mortally wounded characters lose one health chip. Yeah, two-hand weapon. You can't hold the knife. Oh, okay. Yeah. Huh? What's it say? I got to drop that. Time. Mortally it. wounded lose a chip. Lose a chip. I got nothing to lose. Okay. Literally. <laughs> All right. We got your go. Okay. Well, here you go, Wingus. This game is rapidly coming to a close because of the lone rider already. Yep. Hey. 
And that keeps it from dragging on. Right? Three. One, two, three. <sighs> Four. One, two, three. And yeah, you are not gonna like what's three. About to happen. That's fine. I'll stay right there in efforts to make the game go faster. But I do have an axe, so I'm probably okay. And I ran twice and gotten Nache's little face right there. And that is my turn. Nache. Oh, wait, nope. I got to roll for my old man. Yep. Three. Three get you there. I'll get there and do the loot. I'll get you there. All right. Finally, the old timer got something. He got the Colt Revolving Shotgun. And it's minus one to reload. Re reload. And if busted, disables left hand of holder because it's big gunpowder bags. And damage varies with range. I've noticed that with the shotguns, damage varies with range. All right. We ready? My turn? Yeah, go for it, buddy. <coughs> Hit me with out it. of the pocket of my dress. <laughs> okay. I pull out a Colt Walker and shoot you in the face. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> you aim first. Well, that's not fun at all. <laughs> now, you can actually pull it out. Hold on a second now. Action to shoot. Hold on a second now. Can I challenge him with an axe? Yes. All right. I'll challenge. All right. So I'm going to throw. Uh, get after it, get I'm please. meleeing him with the axe or just throwing it at him? Well, you'd be throwing it at him. Okay, that's what I thought. So I'm going to two. Let's see who does it first. I ah, do. he gets to do it first. All right. So one to two spaces. It's a 19. Wait, wait, wait. Let's set the picture here. Nache just brought the big So Nache is standing one space away. In a dress. In a dress. <laughs> pulled out a revolver, and I threw an axe at him. <laughs> yes. Can you imagine this happening in any other game besides either gunfight or ball? Oh, no. This is like all the makings of a girl fight, and then it's like, oh, wait, that's actually a dude. Yeah. I'm going to scratch your eyes out. Do it quick. <laughs> you were saying? All right. Resolve your shooting attack. Yes, hex to hex. The sneak, who looks like a pissed off Buddy Epson, is wearing a dress. Yes. Yes. Show the dress off on the camera. There it is. It's a beautiful purple frock. Back it up a little bit. There you go. So where this is happening is in an alley behind the general store. Yeah. Jesus. <laughs> no, yours isn't oh, sketchy. <laughs> this is where it's happening at. Right All right. there. That's Somebody call a sheriff. We got women fighting behind the general store. <laughs> Sounds like, sounds like behind the Dollar General in Pittsfield. Yeah. That's, 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 that's way too close to that. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So I need a 16 or less. Now, you didn't move. You're, you're in a challenge, so it's minus three. Yep. Yeah, I'm starting at 19. Okay. <clears throat> a two. A two. Well, I'd say that'll do it. Yeah, that'll do it. All right. <clears throat> Oh, come Did you on. shoot him in the buttocks? What? Did you <laughs> shoot me in the ass? <laughs> yes, it is not even the guy who has his buttocks protected. Let's see the card. Let's see the card. Oh, zoom out, Matt. On the video oh, screen. Oh, oh, no, no, no. Right there, right there. Buttocks. There it is. Bold as brass. I can't run, so I have to take the, <laughs> the boot. And she has the 10 gallon hat, <clears throat> so that doesn't help her. You're not wearing it on your ass. <laughs> yeah, wrong head. Yeah, but the old timer has that, you know, so. <laughs> frying pan on his ass. All right, and wait. That's yeah, not you, what are you doing? You take two points of damage. Two points of damage, it is. <laughs> now I'm going to throw ah. this damn axe at you. Okay, well, what is what is your starting accuracy on the axe? It's, so it's, it's, it's one. 20, being one away. Minus one. That's a 19. And then minus five for being a thrown up in the act. And then 19. minus three for being in a challenge. So you're minus nine. 
yeah. flailing around trying to get a good eleven or less. <laughs> eleven or less is fine with me. Your axe, your axe throwing technique must be five. Very good. Yeah. Draw. Ooh, he landed it. Oh, I get a dirty tricks card by the way. So do you know, Nacho? So a wounds card. Uh, this one says, "What's that say, Nacho?" In the spine. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, 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 wait a second. How did I shoot you in the ass and you hit me in the back? Yeah. You guys are doing some weird dancey stuff. This is like Brazilian dance fighting with guns and an axe. <laughs> you get a boot because it says you can't run and you fall prone. And you get 1d3 plus 3 damage. You just got an axe to the spine. Jesus. 1, so plus 3, so 4. four. <laughs> Shifts down. Oh, okay, McMurray, would you like to recap what just happened? So, oh. the so this this nice young lady just got ambushed by this dude in a dress who <laughs> shot at her with a great big old Colt Walker. Unfortunately, the exceedingly long barrel and uh, and heavy weight of that Colt Walker apparently was a little too much for his frail little dress arms, and he wound up shooting her in the ass. In response. She like did some wild matrix stuff and flung an axe like behind him, but it's a boomerang axe, so it came back and smoked him in the spine because he's a low down, dirty, well, I'm bad person. And uh, and that boomerang axe hit him in the spine, knocked him on his own ass. Uh, as far as I know, he's not paralyzed. So you got that going for you. But he fell down like a goof, and now she's gonna curb stomp. <laughs> So I, know, oh. I know we're not supposed to get super role playing into this, but okay. that was too fun. If you don't like this board game, there's something wrong with you. Exactly. <laughs> there's the quote for the back of the box. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord love a duck. I believe that's, that's me. That's awesome. Oh, that was epic. I cannot believe I Oh, I threw the axe, too. What happens with that? It's in my back. Do I get to keep it? <laughs> yes. That's the um, bonus. You get to keep it. <laughs> it, it I'll tell you what. Day, you do not want to take that axe. You right. in here. What, There's what, some what? truth. There's some truth to that in that mm -hmm. the target guy is going to get to decide where it falls within one space. After it's oh, been, yeah. Yeah. Okay, so where's it gonna go? I feel like not my should, turn yet. I feel like it should go behind you. No, no, yeah. the axe. Where, where you, you pick where it's going to fall because I threw it. <laughs> not Jay's like over here. <laughs> uh, one space adjacent. This is the matrix. <clears throat> hey, where's that gun? You're down. Which gun? The rifle. That one where he right fell? there. Oh, yeah, okay. in front of where I shot him. Yes. Yeah. Oh, see now that was worth it. That was worth my turn right there. He says, oh, you're not going to like it. I said, no, you're not either. <laughs> and uh, John, John Young says, these games are so spaghetti western. That they yeah. are. Hex to Hex says, oh, my God, too funny. So that that for sure was, I mean, that right there, that's. That's the game. That's, if that doesn't I mean, sell the game, <laughs> nothing is going to sell this game. And, and, and to top it all off, if you were a bystander, not you know just away from it all. It would have been two chicks just yes. flailing at each other. What one of them is going seriously on. did not look like one really ugly, <coughs> ugly chick. Yes, <laughs> one of them is a powerful ugly creature, but that's okay. And then there's the sneak. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was so fun. <laughs> on to me. Let's have uh, the yeah, cow McLeary, your turn. <laughs> the cowboy is going to pick up that item right there in the outhouse. So he's fishing around in the turds. All right. He's looking for blind mullets. <laughs> yeah. And I have a solid off. Oh, no, I don't have to tell you guys this. Searching for the Browns at the Super Bowl? Yeah. yeah. They, they <laughs> do it. They do it. Go cheese. You got to reveal it. You got to conceal it. No, I'm going to go ahead and use it. It's a solid off shotgun. So I got that in my hands now. All right. And he is going to run, please. No, he's not. Dirty trick. Can't run. Well, he's got a foot stuck in there. Uh, <laughs> read, read, uh, All right, this dirty trick here <clears throat> I just played on McMurray. says, fleeing bystander, you play on an enemy. A fleeing bystander gets in the way, may not run this turn. Somebody definitely just ran into the outhouse door. <laughs> in a big hurry. Yeah, somebody's got that somewhere to exactly be. exactly why I played Somebody's got somewhere to be, and I am blocking them. Sorry, bystander. Now, can you walk? 
he yes, but he jumped out of the outhouse. He jumped. He jumped out of the toilet <laughs> turlet there. Yeah, <laughs> there's piss on the outside of the turlet. Hey, what'd you do? Take my shotgun out of the toilet. <laughs> so I got one, two, three on the walk. Okay. Uh, there's always, there's, there's always cash in the banana stand. Exactly that reference. Yeah, yes. buddy. There's, there's always a shotgun in the, in the outhouse. Oh, John Young, Young says. <clears throat> Son and I played a Gunfighters Ball demo at uh, at a con in 2019. He won the game, never firing a shot. Wow, was that? Uh, what? He ran around diving through windows in back of, uh, in the back of buildings, diving back out, and faced off with this with la with last guy, threw a stick of dynamite, and took out the <laughs> <laughs> was, that, was that Adepticon? <clears throat> He said, <coughs> 19. Yeah, Jonathan, was that a Ducky Con? Let's see what he says. It's going to take him a second to hear it. Uh, or, or Little Wars, maybe. Hero is going to attack. Or Hero is going to run. All right. For two. Two. One, two. And he's going to pick up this. Which, which you got? Okay, hold on. Wait, 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 wait. Did something flicker? <laughs> yeah. Horse bites. What's that? Horse bites. What? Horse bites. Wait at any time. Oh, good. One character standing directly beside or in front of a space with a horse takes one damage. Okay. <clears throat> that being said, I just picked up what? a Colt Sheriff's model. He's which I'm equipping. Got bit by a horse? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, bit by a horse. They will bite. They will bite. I remember the wackiest shit happened to you. I am. Some guy jumped out of the turret. <laughs> <laughs> and then you got bit by a damn horse. <laughs> Correct. That's okay. I got a good pistol out of it. So I'm show right. the car. Show the card. Drop that card down there so Colt, so the sure. can see the old no the hit the bit horse the horse bite oh, card. Yeah. Horse bite. Yeah, there yeah. you go. Horse bites. And so there's a there's an anecdote from <laughs> yeah, first, some horses do bite. And there was an anecdote from from a Napoleonic battle. A horse bit a guy's face off in the middle of a in the middle of battle. Yeah. Uh, Recruits Con in Lee Summit, Missouri. Oh, nice. What a good convention, John. Yeah. I hope to see you there this uh, September. Yeah. We'll Come find all, us. We will all be there. Yeah, we will. And I will have my entire Western town probably running Gunfighters Ball and uh, a few other Western games. <clears throat> and we'll just we'll just have to have this there for, you know. The oh, this rider. will be here. That, that, this is going to be at definitely. Hey, be. Recruits. Um, if I can manage to bring it all and do it all, you know, I'll bring I have my, I'll bring my a really good group of friends. I'll bring my job run games. I think that that might be able to work out. I don't know. Yeah. I mean, I don't know where I would find the good group of friends. Maybe the ones that throw axes at friends. Not these oh, wait, no, that's me. <laughs> <laughs> all right, let's do the, uh, let's roll the, let's roll the Lone Rider. Lone the Rider. Here we go. Let's see if this will end anytime Four. soon. Four. One, two, three, four. Players with a dead character get a dirty tricks card. That's an items card. That's an item. That's a dirty tricks card. There you go. You can't even see. Well, because I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> so potentially, uh, I'll zoom out and show you guys where the lone rider is. Potentially, oh, point yeah, it, it ends. It's, it's going to end after this round. Yeah, yeah, more more than likely. There. No, it, it has to. It, it has to. Yeah. <clears throat> right, you can't roll a one on on two d threes. John says, "Heck yeah, fan con ever, fan, fan con ever." I hope we can all be there. We oh, uh, definitely will so, be if it is there. Jo Jonathan, are you uh, close there. to the Kansas City area? You don't have to be specific, but are you close? <laughs> I travel for recruits. In his defense, I right. have exactly. <laughs> Matt, sure shot, but I've heard him from Yeah, he's looking for a couch to crash on, John. Yeah. So if you wouldn't mind, <laughs> Matt, I got family in the area. We're good. Yeah, I'm. I'm probably gonna get a hotel uh, like I did last time, unless I got, there's you know somebody who has family in the area that might be able to couch or something. Anyway, so uh, where are we at? You or me? Okay. <laughs> I'd say so since you're ahead prone ahead. on top of this axe, can I pick that back up even though he's on top? What, of what you're going to do is you're going to come up, step yeah. on my back, and pull it out of me. That's exactly like what I'm like, going to do. Like you, it was a log, or I'm a log. And then attack him with it. <gasps> Give me that. And then you're going to swing at me? Oh, wait, no, I, I'm stunned. Oh, okay. yeah. Because I'll just point out. 
because it's a, you're adjacent to the space and because it's not in his inventory, you can pick it up. Okay. Yeah. And I, that's all I can do because oh. I was uh, I did the challenge and I had a stun chip. So that was first action. Second action was to pick my back, uh, my back, my axe out of ba uh, his back. So <laughs> that's all she can do. And the old timer, in, in the interest of uh, it's probably going to end the game, uh, he needs to run. Four. four. One, two, three, four. Behind the horses. No, nope, you're not behind the horses. You're beside the horses. Beside the horses. Hopefully I didn't get bit. Nope. <clears throat> uh, this is the last turn, so I'm going to shoot. Okay. I, I, I'm, I've got to. So. I'll challenge. You're going to challenge? Are you within no, we're six? Outside. I think we're outside. One, two, three, four. Wait, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. But you do have cover. I do have cover. I do have cover. Yeah. Uh, Jonathan lives five minutes from uh, the high school. Oh, beautiful. So we'll crash at his place. All right. <laughs> no more <more>, Jonathan. <laughs> We're nicer than that. All right. So shoot. What are you I shooting just at? find the guys with the Rockies wore them t-shirts. Yep. That's pretty much what it was going to be. Or the absurdly tall dude with a mustache. That works too. Yeah, the absurdly I'm not tall. absurdly tall. Weird. I'm 6'3-ish. Okay. That's so the Pew looking guy. The, the tall dude with a mustache who isn't John Walker. Yeah. Although, go, go say hi to John Walker, too. He's yeah, good please. Dude. He's a good dude. How many spaces am I again? Seven. 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 Okay, so seven spaces away <clears throat> puts me at 11 accuracy to start. And it's going to be a minus one damage on this. So seven minus. So it's 11. You move how many? Minus four. So seven. What, what did you start at? 11. 11. Mm -hmm. Minus, minus one four, to ten. seven. Mm -hmm. You're not in a challenge. Mm -hmm. uh, target is behind cover, yep. which is another minus two, so you're at a five. That's why you said minus one, right? <clears throat> For damage. Oh, okay. So five or less to hit. Wait a minute. I'm not going to shoot. What? Oh, yeah, I am. Yeah, I am. A six. Oh, six. Not, wait, six. Try again. Play after a dice roll by any player. I want to see if you can what shoot the? it. All right. Thank you, Dante. Help, help, help. Yeah, 17. I wish it was a 20. That would have been fantastic. Boo. <laughs> Boo. Hey, I did my best. I wanted to go out like the, the axe fight we went into the last game. <laughs> right? Epic. All right. Am I go? Yes. Yeah. That's all I could do. I got one shot off with the old man. It's going to end quick. Stand up and hit. How dare you die early? Okay, so <laughs> uh, I have a question. Can we back up to Lone Ryan? Shush. Okay. If I am prone, does that affect my shooting? No. All right. So I'm going to stay prone, and I'm going to aim and shoot. With this one? Yep. I challenge with my axe. I'm going to throw it at you again. All right. <clears throat> and you're within six? I'm like one away. One away. Oh, okay, that one. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Final attack. Hold on. Just a moment with you guys. I'm going to play insurmountable odds. See so your hits or misses and your misses or hits. Oh, I love it. I didn't know what? anybody had that card. <laughs> yeah, How long have you been game? holding that? A long time. Since, <laughs> since turn two. <laughs> All right. so so let's get a shot at that card. Yeah. We're uh, going to put it in the, the bank here. Yep, that one. Yep. That, that one has been uh, that fairly early on that we started having that in play testing, and it it stuck in there, and it has been. You know, there's only one in the deck, and it's really valuable, so people don't this waste turn, it. Hits count as what? Misses and misses count as hits. Yeah. So. So good luck. I, I shit heads. Basically, <laughs> I have to roll a twenty. Uh, let's see who rolls first. Three, one. You go first. I go first. So I'm one away. So that's <laughs> turns a uh, twenty into a nineteen because yep. I'm throwing the axe. No, you're not mm -hmm. throwing it. Yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Minus five for the accuracy. I did not move. Nope. I'm in a challenge, so it's another minus mm -hmm. three. I'm prone. So minus eight, minus nine total, right? So it's an no, eleven. No, you take a negative for. They're gonna try to try to miss. No, they target prone and. Two pl oh, yeah, but it's two plus, plus, plus yeah. So, In because order to all those minuses, this is going to be great because if I roll high, I'm yeah. okay. 
which I did at a 14. <laughs> so that's the axe that hit. You take a dirty tricks, and I'm going to do one black damage, which is no, your, see, what that does hit, though. Yeah, doesn't it? Yes, yeah. yes. Oh, do I roll it over because no, you I had an 11. Oh, you needed an 11? Oh, yeah, yeah so that 14's okay. a miss. I tried helping you not, Jay. Sorry, buddy. Yeah, so, even though you screwed me over, I tried helping this you. This is out. the right hand. I did. <laughs> this is the right hand. Your hand is disabled, and you drop any one-handed weapon in that slot. Which, which is, was you, my. You drop it. Yeah, so I'm dead. I, <laughs> um, so he can't shoot back at me since he dropped it. <clears throat> okay, I've got a question. It wasn't. Now, now is, is that hand disabled? Unless it says hand disabled, it's very specific. If it says hand disabled, hand disabled. Okay. on the card, then it is. Right. If it doesn't, <clears throat> so I dropped it. Okay, so here's the deal. This is very important. This is very, very important. Does he get his shot off? No, I don't. Because okay. you did before I did. And your damage? Well, Two. <clears throat> mortally wounded. Okay. Two? You already yeah. got a bunch off. Really? You just hit him in the spine with the axe. Yeah. Oh, that's right. <laughs> All right. Jeez. So this is very important. Since I just dropped it with my disabled hand now, can I pick it up with my other hand as an action? Yes. But then you don't have an action to shoot. Why? Because he, he, he aimed with his first action, yeah. and then he shot with his second action. But because his hand was disabled, he wasn't able to get the shot off. That's just a wasted so action. Those were two actions. actions. Yeah. What, where were my yeah. two actions? You aimed, aimed and tried shooting. You tried shooting. So I don't get the shot off no. at all because I dropped it, right? Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> well, I challenged you. <laughs> oh, here we go. So we got a dirty trick. <laughs> uh, it's not going to do any good for me, but I'm going to go ahead and play it anyway. Split, split second decision. Play on anyone at any time. Uh, you may take a bonus action immediately. Whether I'm gonna brawl then, do it. Whoa, that's great. Boom, totally love the icon at the bottom of those cards. <laughs> yeah, because that's what you say when somebody plays it on you. That's right. <clears throat> Every so one of them, I'm gonna brawl you. Yeah, uh, now does that other dirty tricks card stay in? in... No, no, okay. So just you know what, I'm gonna brawl you. You may, with my other action, I'm gonna brawl take a you. bonus action immediately. <laughs> Well, I threw my axe. You no longer have an axe, so I don't. You're just gonna give him your money, man. <laughs> All well, right, he's uh, mortally wounded, um, and he has no weapon. I'm unarmed. So am I. Um, so now we both. I roll the same. Time. Or I'm not. Okay, under brawling, when it says Amy, minus one. What, what does that mean? Hold on a second. Uh, I lost my thing here. Okay, so you're you're in uh, you're having a brawl, right? And um, the uh, let me think. And actually, we do need to clarify whether the uh, the the insurmountable odds insurmountable stays or not. odds is still in play or not? Since it's still the same, it's still the same turn. He just played another dirty tricks card. That allowed him to have another action. So During I was thinking turn. that insurmountable. He's, ex he's extended the turn, is what he's yeah, done. So that turn's so still, still, still in play. So Good. Still in play. Turn. And the other thing about aiming there is <clears throat> the idea is that um, you make yourself vulnerable by putting your effort into okay, concentrating so on your target and aiming. So this guy can get a sucker punch at you or something because you're you have to <clears> okay. change what you're paying attention to. Right. So that's so why I, that's there. I'm unarmed. I was aiming, I'm prone, I'm mortally wounded, and I have a wound, a wounded hand. Hand, slot disabled, so you got a minus five. So minus five. five. Okay, now, do we roll simultaneous for this? Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, so I'm unarmed, mm -hmm. I don't have a disabled hand, I'm not mortally wounded, I'm not prone. So if I lose the roll, I win. That's right. Hits or misses and misses or hits. So we roll a d20 for this? No, yeah. No, um, a brawling is brawl. a, uh, uh, 2d3. High two roller inflicts a blue wound. Okay. All right. Give me the other d3 there. All right. So I'm. All right. So, so if I roll below you, I win. 
That's right. <laughs> you minus five. You guys, <laughs> you guys are welcome for this. There you go. I, I got rolled four. double ones. That makes me a negative three. <laughs> so you you win, right? You take a blue damage. <laughs> Just do it. Haymaker, fall prone. Uh, back one d three spaces. What'd you do? Give her a dead leg. You're on the ground. <laughs> one. <laughs> you were on the ground. You stood up and gave me a hangmaker. A haymaker. All right. You're with a spine injury. Yeah, with yeah, a spine, spine injury. <laughs> <laughs> you can't pull me shit up. Hey, Murray, would you, you like to uh, walk us through what just happened? I have no idea. What you're <laughs> Other than I played a dirty trick that really screwed with some people. You wildly missed, yet landed. <laughs> yeah. Like, you tried to... I had no idea. Like, you invented karate all of a sudden. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right. So I've got guys going still. Uh, Is it your turn? Yeah. <laughs> okay. My <laughs> hero is going to run. Now that game ended in a is going to end in a glorious fashion. I'm so glad I did that. Yeah, this is ridiculous. <laughs> All right, so I'd like to run that, Jay, please. All right, let me back out so everybody can see. Where you got four is. up to. Where are you going to go? All right, McMurray. Oh, too far. There we go. A lot of action going on there. It literally is like like he said, spaghetti western type. Well, it's the theater of the absurd, you know. <laughs> and and you gave it to the most absurd players. Mm -hmm. What? Stop! What? Right there. Horse kicks. Oh, play at any time. <laughs> One character in the space behind a horse takes a black wound <laughs> and rides a dirty card. Murray's face right now is like. Are you shitting me? One D three. Give me, give me, give me D three. God damn. Three. I'm mortally wounded. <laughs> He's got one chip left. He's got one chip left. He got bit. He got, he got bit by a horse and kicked by the same horse. No, he got bit. No, no, he got bit. Yeah. Red horse does not like you. He hates you. Yeah. Are there rules for shooting horses in this game? Uh, no. <laughs> Okay. Keep keep going with your move. Wait, 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 Murray. What I have four? Yeah. I'll do that for you just for fun. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> I like it. Beautiful. Uh, all right. I'm supposed to shoot at Matt though. You uh, can't come on. Hold on. You can't park that animal there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's a violation. All right, so I'm shooting at Matt. I am challenge. Rolling. Oh, you dirty. <laughs> challenge with what? I got a rifle. Who are you shooting at? This guy. Oh, okay. he's one, two, okay. three okay. away. I'm sorry. I've... So we rolled to see who fires first. <clears throat> who shot who and who fired first? Dripping death, wet, bloodthirst. One. It's going to be me. Three. Murray. Yeah. Murray. Okay. Murray, you shoot first, sir. So I moved four. I'm in a challenge. Down three. You are behind cover. Down two more. So I'm down nine. So I need a 10 to hit. Unless you have a dirty tricks card that changes that. Nope. Okay. It makes us miss. Roll me a 10, please, Mr. Nat J. Yeah. Or if you want to roll a 1, that'd be cool, too. A 10. All right. He so literally that. rolled a 10. All right. He called it. Matt, there's your, there's your dirty trick. Thank you. And I just shot you in the left hand. Hand disabled, drop any one-handed weapon in that slot. You don't. Uh, so does he drop his shotgun? If he's got a two-handed weapon and his hand is disabled? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, Drop. wait a minute. No, wait, wait, wait. Yeah, it no, takes two okay. hands. It it says two hands right there. So, yeah, if it, if it's a two-handed weapon, two yeah. hands are required to, to hold it. Drop. Drop. It says so drop he, any one-handed yeah, weapon. Yeah, so he, you just fire oh, one-handed one now. Yeah. So not taking your old D3 for me? Hand disabled. For three. Three. I need to put a hand disabled token on my – which hand does it say? Just like <clears throat> Okay. And you take three damage. Three damage. All right, not a big deal. I can still fire back, right? Okay. So my accuracy is 14, and it goes down because I have a hand disabled. And you're in a challenge. And I'm in a challenge, so minus and five. And I'm cover. And the horses are cover. Where's the cover at? The horses. Minus two. Target behind cover. Oh, I see it. Oh, okay. Minus two. 
Are they? I get a minus two. So you're at for minus sure. nine also. Yeah, but that's if you're behind cover. I mean, I got a horse in front of me. <laughs> uh, so I, what is my? What is you're my, a minus nine. So minus you need a ten nine. as well. well I, no, I I start off with a fourteen. Oh, so you need a five. Yeah. I like that. Fourteen. Yeah, I rolled a fourteen, so that's a miss. Wait. Where's my down? Where's my oh. I okay, hoping, I was hoping uh, I'm gonna play this dirty tricks card just because uh, it's called the jig is up <clears throat> one character must flip their concealed weapons and items face up uh, You okay? Well, the unfortunate thing is that I don't my cowboy isn't close enough to use this Which I was really hoping to so I've got the derringer I've got a detachable stock, which is nice, but what I was really wanting to use was the dynamite oh, He's way too far to use it. He's gonna try and run though. And that was, uh, was that your last character? You still got one more. I have. You got one. the guy who's the stuff in the outhouse. <clears throat> He's <laughs> hit by the bystander guy. <laughs> so you're going to run five. Where are you going? So I'm trying to decide. I'll, I can't get to anybody, but. Maybe that would be a best one. Stompy, stompy on that. This has definitely been. A very characterful game. Go ahead and run again, that chain, if you would. Four. So, one of the things that you'll notice is, I don't think, with the exception of maybe the one where you get the gold off the table, there's you're not rewarded for camping. You're not rewarded for staying out of the fight. You oh, have yeah. to get in there because you got to collect bounties on other guys. So you can't, there's not like a, a loophole where you can like get a bunch of points and avoid getting in fights. Yeah. I think that's it. That's everybody. So roll for the Lone Rider, which is a two. And it is, it a, is two. a two, which means game over. Game over. Game over, man. Game over. McMurray again. Well played, gentlemen. Wow. I was the only one to collect a bounty of $2,500. America. On the outlaw, <laughs> the hero killed the outlaw. That seems about right. That, yeah, that seems about right. Oh shit, I gotta go. Well, that's where the end yeah. of our game is. I'm gonna be heading out soon too. Right there in glorious fashion. So that was the second playthrough. I'm sold. Not a social visit. Free for all. Totally sold. I mean, what other game? Guys, there's there's not a lot of games on Kickstarter that you can that people have played first off other than the creator. You guys can watch us play this. You saw how fun that is. I'm not a huge board game guy. Oh. I already backed it. I laughed. That that was the most I've laughed at a at a game in a long time. And that's exactly that's how what I like about playing yeah. games is just the camaraderie of friends and and the absurdity that that this game plays out. I mean spaghetti western. This, oh, is, this like is what that. we found. And I gotta tell you, uh Two or three of the guys who who worked in, worked on this, especially one, my son, who's an adult, my adult son, Tommy, um, him and a couple of his friends, um, they're they played a lot of video games that are like this. You know, they play like uh, Red Dead and stuff. Well, like Team Fortress. I'm talking stuff that's hmm. almost cartoonish. You know, that that taunting each other and just silliness and craziness, mad yeah. gap stuff, and the absurd stuff is all part of the game. And, um, and and that played a big part in the development of this thing. So yeah, I, I just that was the most fun I've had in a board game in a long time. I mean, I, honestly, well, that is great to hear you say. <laughs> I'm glad to hear you say that. I mean, now that I'm playing with you know someone other than my mid maxing son who just runs at you and brawls at you, and we're all doing different things and stuff like that all game, basically. I mean, you're, we were timid the first game. We were, we didn't know how it yeah. worked. <clears throat> and once we got the feel for it, we were rolling, you know? Yeah. But I'm saying this, this game could very easily be done in well under an hour. I love the challenging. <clears throat> yeah. The fact that you can't just be shot down in the street without being able to do anything like, Oh, Hey, what's going on? Uh, you know? <laughs> that is, that, from the very early when I started working on Gunfighters Ball, that was a high priority for me because I, I had played Legends of the Old West and I kind of like Legends 
because of the ability to build the posses and stuff, you know? Yeah. But, um, but that aspect of, of games, workshop games, where you stand still while I walk. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know if you ever, um, probably, probably didn't run across the situation, but. Um, you know, got to go real quick. He's going to say ta ta. Oh, yep. Bye, Forrest. Good to see you, buddy. Hey, thanks for playing. Yeah. Thanks, thanks for backing it. Thanks, especially for backing it, man. What What's that, Forrest? I said, thanks for backing it. Thanks for making a game that's outstanding and super worth backing. Go back <laughs> this, guys. Jesus. <laughs> you heard it from McMurray first. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys. Thanks. We'll see, see you, buddy. McMurray. Take care. Yeah, I, I, man, oh man, I want to play again. <laughs> well, uh, we will be definitely playing this. We'll be bringing it with us wherever we can. Um, yeah. Especially uh, if they end up having recruits this year, uh, this will be at recruits. Uh, Probably at least three copies. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, for whatever. Uh, now, when's fulfillment of the Kickstarter? So we, when we get, when the Kickstarter wraps up, February is Chinese New Year. Nothing happens in February. Okay, so yeah. then you figure the printing will probably start. Uh, Panda will get all of their um, game materials they need, all the artwork and stuff, and then they'll start working on it. It's supposed to be six months of manufacturing and then up to six months of shipping and over. So that means it'll it'll come in sometime the latter part of the year. And then um, <clears throat> we're using a company called Quartermaster Logistics, and they do most of the big game Kickstarters, and they're really experienced. Um, you barcode everything, and you send it to them, and then they do the actual fulfillment. But it depends on how many backers we have. You know, if it's somewhere in the neighborhood of the Gunfighters Ball um, game, we'll probably just fulfill it ourselves. But um, but anyway, uh, I think, I mean, I think uh, at the earliest Christmas, maybe uh, a full year. But I'm hoping they get it done faster. It's not a very complicated thing to produce. Yeah. Um, I mean, even at that point, you know, we'll still, we'll still have this at recruits. Oh so, yeah, you'll have that copy. And yeah. I might even have, um, by that time, I might, I will most certainly have, um, we go, hey, thanks a lot, wardrobe. Uh, the, um, Uh, it, by that time, um, I'll be able to send you uh, the woodcut uh, tokens, the laser cut tokens. Okay. Um, they're wood. They'll look really cool <clears throat> because they'll be all burned and everything. Um, and I'll be able to send you uh, probably the plastic versions of the figures because I'll be getting some advanced copies of those. Excellent. Excellent. That's awesome. <laughs> I mean, I'll bring this to recruits this year if they have it for sure. And, and we'll uh, have it off off to the side as a side game. I'm hitting the dice. Put it over here. But uh, sorry, we're cleaning up. <laughs> That's all right. <clears throat> what a fun game. What a fun game. It is. Uh, Nache, do you have any final thoughts about it? <clears throat> what I like about it as a miniatures gamer is it gives me the feel of a miniatures game, but I don't have to screw around with painting and, and building terrain and all that <laughs> other garbage. I, I like to play games. I don't like to prepare for games. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I so, hear you there. I, I love playing miniatures games. So exactly. it, this is, for me, it's it's the perfect uh uh, perfect plan in there. Uh, also, on top of that, <clears throat> it's just it's fun. Literally, I what we saw today never would have seen in any other game. You know, it, it wouldn't have even. I mean, you shooting thought. me and then me swinging around with an axe and throwing it. At right. Me. I mean, where else would that happen? <laughs> you know, or or. When was the last time you saw two cowboys in the middle of the street swinging axes at each other? Correct. <laughs> and I think what you see there, what you're seeing reflected there is some 20 something guys who play video games a lot coming in and introducing some of that stuff and fearlessly saying, that'd be fun. Yeah. God, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? <laughs> you know, and they're just jumping in there because they find these crazy items. You know, I think one yeah. of the items in one of the games they play is a frying pan. 
and, and for like no particular reason, it's completely random. And, uh, and with this, you know, we, I, I steered them into the things that are, have a Western feel to them and, and could, you know, become part of the universe of the game. Well, cool. So, yeah. There's a bit of Monty Python in it too, I think. You know what? And that's, that's a, okay. Monty Python. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, all right, man. Well, thanks. I appreciate you joining us, Forrest. Thanks for the game, man. Uh, it was my pleasure, and I really enjoyed seeing you guys well, have a good time. Well, this was very much asked for. Uh, lots of people were asking for a playthrough. Now they have two to watch, and uh, a whole lot of shenanigans happened and uh, and should get, have give players a, a real good feel uh, for what the game is like. So, uh, so I'm really happy with the way uh, this turned out. And we'll probably do this again. We'll probably be breaking this out maybe once every couple months and uh, giving it a whirl. Yep. So, that is excellent. And even after the Kickstarter is over, it'll remain in the pre-order status so that people can still pre-order it after the Kickstarter is over. We just need to okay. make sure we hit the numbers we need to to actually succeed on the Kickstarter and put it into production. Sounds excellent. good. All right. Uh, uh, Force. <laughs> Say goodbye. <laughs> there he is. Bye There's bye. the game. <laughs> All right. Let me All get right. It here. All right, everybody. Till next time. This was the Gunfight Royal playthrough. Mm -hmm.